because if the dance of electromagnetic radiation from space with the inorganic plasmatic life forms can affect us this much, perhaps it also affects the very form and construct of the human genome. After all, it says that we are created in God's image. Besides the obvious, like the Fibonacci sequence, is there scientific evidence to back up this ancient notion of not only being made in God's image, but evolving over time according to the word. And if after death, the ancient pharaohs went into the stars to join the Netzer, which by the way, were seen as forces of nature and not gods, then who were these beings and how old are they? And is there a chance that these pharaohs are working with the Netzer today to manipulate life here on earth to avoid another great reset? This might be what the geometry of the pyramids and ancient religious texts in their own unique way have been trying to tell us all along.